clean this up. What's going on YouTube? So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys some new packages that just arrived. That's part of the HD front end that I'm gonna be doing to my Tahoe. Here we have the bumper pad and the HD grill. And I still gotta get my HD hood, so that's gonna be, that's gonna wait a little while, but then I'm gonna get the HD Z01 hood. Um, but yeah, man, let's start opening this up. have it we got the chrome emblem right here and we are going to install it after we're done opening the other box and i'm not sure if this is the bottom piece or the top but we're going to install it either way yeah, this is the black grill that I got from eBay. Here she is. We're gonna open up the chrome emblem bow tie. It was not really chrome, but it was polished. But uh, I'm pretty sure you can bring a little bit more shine out of that. It's not really like my other one on my stock grill, but uh, we'll see what happens. Um, but uh, yeah, it's a little bit curved, so hopefully that helps with the aftermarket HD grill, porque the OEM ones, they have like a little indent where you put the chrome emblem and it's all flush all the way around, but on the aftermarket, so you're gonna see that little bump out. Here we got the hardware that it came with so we're gonna open this up and here comes the the threads right here that goes to the back of it which right here and this is the bottom you can see it says down and we're gonna install them right here just like that and here's the other one got my bow tie right here with the two little screws and I'm gonna align them with these holes right here. Just like that. And this is how she looks. As you can see, it's not the same at all. We're gonna see what we're gonna do about that. Hopefully we can get a little bit more shine out of that. So now I'm gonna install the washers that it came with and as well as the hex nuts right there. And then just get them tightened up. And there she is. The emblem's on. And there is no gap. As I was talking about. That curve really helped a lot. So I already have the top one done. And as you guys can see, it is an overlay. It's not an insert like my old one. But uh, it's pretty easy to install as well. All you really need is little screw or bolts that they give you you stick them through that little hole right here there's gonna be a hole on the billet grill right there you stick that bolt through the hole and then you install this this thing right here that looks like a little wing and you install it this way that way it can get right here your grill and you just hand tighten it and that's how it looks. I'm gonna get back to you guys whenever I install the bottom one. So we got the bow tie and the billet grill installed. You guys let me know what you guys think about it. Should I keep it or should I not? But that's it for today, YouTube. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Hopefully you like this video, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Peace.